Hello everybody, this is Badger Wild, and we are back with the Space Engineers mod review video. This time we are reviewing a new mod that uh, saw this and it was actually pretty interesting. I thought, hey, I'm going to use this in one of my next playthroughs. This is going to be one of the mods we're going to install at some point. Because it is just a utilitarian device that I'm amazed Space Engineers and Kane hasn't just shoved into the game already. So without further ado, let's get started. So, for those of you that are wondering what I'm talking about, it's this little mod right down here. Now we have the F-302 back out. We also have a Bobcat floating in space. It needs to be recovered. And under here, we've got a new piece of equipment. This is the Harpoon. Now this thing is an amazing little mod, which can be attached. I, I don't know how to actually install this thing it appears to have a thing on the back here that you can install it but powering this thing up is actually quite simple if you look here on the deal we've got fire we've got reel in on number two and we've got reel out on number three and fire determines whether this thing attaches or not now this is just a utilitarian mod but it is so effective for what we have to do with it i'm gonna fly the f302 up to this thing here we are then going to... Can I fire? Nope, we can't fire with a click, but... Do we have it? I think we got it. And it just kept going off. Okay. <clears throat> we'll try one more time. Fly right up to it here without hitting it. And... Alright, we have it. So number two, we're going to reel it in there. Number three, we're going to reel out as we back up here. Yee! <laughs> well, I wasn't paying very good attention to that, but we've still got it. We still got it. We, we hit something, but we st we're okay. We're okay. Now, unfortunately, the front end of the F-302 is built like a brick on this. But you can see right here, we've got this thing fully latched on to the F-302 and we can fly off with it if we wish so let's just hit thrusters and as you can see we have this thing fully locked in it is it's moving around on us but if you wanted to take this thing let's let's go ahead and just have some fun here let's go ahead and detach that and let's fly to one of these asteroids over here. Oh, wait, we've got one right over here. Let's fly the F-302 over to this. This is something that I find rather interesting of this. So this is this is just a mod you could use for piracy incursions on other ships. As you can see, we can just latch this thing on, just pull it. You could do this on uh, ground bases very easily use it to latch onto things. We're going to test it out on this asteroid real quick. Because I wonder if we can do, like in uh, Stargate, where they would fly up to it and launch the anchors and just grab onto the asteroid and just pull themselves down to it. So anyway, pulling up on this asteroid here. Hopefully this doesn't end in disaster. So we're going to get close. to this asteroid. We're going to fire him. And we're on. Check that out. And... So as long as I keep pushing this, we will start reeling ourselves in. So apparently they're reeling in. We can turn ourselves like this. I don't know. I don't know how we can get it to automatically reel in. Let's see. Let's go into K here. In the K mode. Let's look through here. We're bound to have a harpoon right here. Harpoon. Uh, it doesn't have any extra stuff on it. So I guess the only way we're going to reel something in is that we just do this. We're just going to have to sit here and just keep pressing it until this thing just reels itself all the way in. And mind you, we're not reeling the asteroid, we're reeling ourselves in. Let's go ahead and turn off the inertial dampeners. 
That seems to be stopping us pretty good. Can we pull this asteroid? Nope. <laughs> so once once we're latched onto this thing with this harpoon, we we are there. So yeah, this is just a very cool little mod right here. You can just latch on, anchor yourself to a base or something, and just kind of reel yourself in. Which is the cool part about this. And that, that's that's what I, I was considering with this mod was, you know, it's, it's kind of like the F-02 things. Here we are, we're just attached at the moment, and then we just hit this. But yeah, just a nifty little deal. How far will it go? Oh, jeez, that has a range. Oh, that has a nice range to it. I wonder what we could grab on. You could use something like this on the side of a ship. Say you're moving up to engage another ship or something like that. And you fire the harpoons and latch onto it, like broadside it with harpoons. Uh, so something interesting to think about there. You know, just just a very cool mod. Like I said, very easy, uh, I might add, to install. Because we look through here, it's got show on HUD on off on off we've got fire and detach harpoon which is the same thing we also have reel in and reel out so you could just i could just imagine this two land ships coming at each other on uh the one deal whereas it or two aerial ships that are set to like certain areas one side just fires a bunch of harpoons and hits the other one and they start reeling them in and they've got to shoot the harpoon positions out of the ship as it prepares for piracy boarding <laughs> You probably latch onto another truck and try to yank it over or something like that. Put these on like a turret and fire them. But yeah, like I said, this is a nifty little mod here. And we're attached. You see right there, we're not we're not going anywhere. Let's get full speed and see what happens. See if I can yank this thing out. For science, we're gonna pull some redneck stuff. <laughs> like I said, a really cool mod, and it's got it's got all the it just attaches a line, and the line stays like a motion point. I can see this thing being used to like grab a ship and just pull it, and then you club haul like that. Let's try that again. Let's try that club haul maneuver again. We'll turn off inertial dampeners. Five well, again. This is getting to be a long video. There you go. Now you're club hauled around it. <clears throat> that, that, that's just a really cool mod right there. I'm enjoying it. I wish there was a smaller version of this for uh, your uh, astronaut. Or for your engineer. That way you could attach a line just in case something stupid happens. You know, float away. I think that would be a lot better for your hydrogen uh, being lost. Having that little attachable line. Maybe there's a mod like that. If you guys find it, let me know. But anyway, this has been the Harpoon mod. If you guys are enjoying it as much as I am. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you all for watching. It's been really rough these last couple of weeks to get videos out. That's just... If it's if it's not been jobs and stuff, it has been other things that have been going on. So I want to thank you guys for watching. Still going to get the content out. Have not given up on the channel, so don't you worry about that. I'm just trying to get out as much as I can. Thank you all for supporting the channel. If you are new and you just discovered me on my little corner of YouTube... Um, give me a, give me a like, give me a subscribe and leave a comment telling me who you are. Uh, just love to hear from you and I don't know, ask me some questions, discuss some stuff. I'm more than willing to talk to you. Also, for those of you that are also wondering, we have a tip jar on subscribe star link is in the description. If you guys want to go over there and drop a dollar, it's basically what it's become now. I haven't been able to figure out anything else to do with that. I'm just at the point of, eh, let it be a tip jar. Uh, all you can really give is like a buck, and it helps. It helps out with the channel. I'm going to come up with something else, something more. I don't. I don't feel right 
just taking people's money without giving y'all something back in return. So I'm working on something with a little more monetary gain to it uh, that also has some product involved for you guys. Also, don't forget Rumble. We have that. And as always, thank you all for watching. Thank you for showing interest in this channel and the videos that I do. And as always, I am Badger Wild saying so stay safe, stay frosty. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye for now.